agree or disagree, it's fine to send documents via instant messengers instead of email. Is it okay to do that? Send a PDF, send a report on Excel sheet via Word on a chat? Letter A, agree. Letter D, disagree. Is it okay to do that? Okay. I don't want to sound like I'm fence sitting here. It will depend, of course, on your company policy. But in 2022, this is totally understandable and acceptable for many clients. Do so. If your company sanctions you to use WhatsApp and Viber, use it. And therefore, you can also exchange information to it because it's more portable. It's more accessible to use instant messengers compared to email. So here's the question. I've been seeing people share files via instant messenger via, instead of email. What do you think of this? I find it too casual because files should be sent via email. I'm going to judge this person because being casual is a state of mind. It's also a culture-driven action. So if 10 years from now, emails are dead, are you still going to use emails? Of course not. If you're going to be using now Microsoft Teams or chat, then that is the platform to use for sharing files. So I would suggest this spill. I'd say something on Viber or WhatsApp. Jane, I'm sending you here a copy of the PDF for your easy access, but I also sent you a copy on email. Let me know if you're able to access it. So one way to make it non-casual is that if you prefer to send it on Viber, try to also replicate the copy on email. Why? Sometimes there are people who will still refuse to catch you on an instant messenger. So give them an option. The only difference is you're trying to test out the waters. You don't know who this person is yet. And if the person agrees that we can just chat, do everything on chat, then by all means do it there. I'm going to give you one caveat, however. Looking at the structure of the technology, it's still better to keep your files on emails. Why? Because in emails, they're all archived, right? If you lose any of the conversations on email, you can contact Outlook or Gmail and they can respond to you quickly, especially if you have a premium or corporate account. That is not the case all the time in instant messengers. If you want to retrieve a chat archive, sometimes it will take you months for you to keep that chat archive. So if you lose the document, you might not be able to retrieve it if you lost your phone. So still have it on email if the file is an issue, is a very critical file.